Aye. Oh, look at Hunter. All right. We are officially home from the New York swing. Been home for actually a little while now, a couple days, maybe a week. Been fishing a little bit, but we have not filmed. So today, we're going to head out on a small little local lake and try to figure out how to catch some really, really tough, educated late summer bass. So it's mid-September-ish now, and, uh, you know, the bite usually slows down this time of year. But this time of year, I actually like to catch. I like to go fishing because catching them is so hard. I feel like it makes you a little bit better and better and better when you fish in tough conditions so these are days when i really like to get you know it's hot we didn't miss the best bite of the day but get out there and try to catch some we'll go find them maybe they're on bait maybe they're you know shallow maybe some are deep mid-depth whatever it takes we'll go catch some so got a new rod out i have not fished with this rod since last year about this time so we'll go try it this is a little bit different than the lakes we've been used to ain't it? yeah these got a little bit small ones in it but a whole lot closer to home it's nice having a uh five minute drive to the lake you know instead of having to drive 18 hours but 18 hours is worth it when you catch a 25 pound smallmouth ain't it mm -hmm. i think my babe caught 27 on one day almost 28 27 12. that's, a good that's almost 28 dude it's a bag of smallies there for sure I feel like that kind of got overlooked with you winning AOL. Yeah, I mean, that's a big bag smallmouth, but this lake right here, though, ain't gonna be no 27 pound bag, but a lot closer to home. We got a truck in the. Alright. Well, there's two ramps because uh, one is occupied. He's got a spray and stuff out. We can go look right there and tell what they're biting. You gonna, you gonna hop in the boat? Yeah. So you know that troll motor has that troll tamer on now. So you gotta flip it up and how to do that? Yeah. So there's a nice boat. Thank you. The fish don't like it as much as I wish they did. That fish right here, though. You just scared them all off. Yeah, man. It's a boat, it's a boat I ramp. I appreciate that. <laughs> I can't help it, dude. They, they built the boat ramp for a boat ramp. You like me to come fish on. <laughs> you can get on there in the rocks or something. What are you talking about? All these TV screens. <laughs> so. They're called fish finders, depth, depth finders, whatever you want to call them. They just show a map, basically. And You heard about Lysco for nothing, or the forward face sonar? Yeah, I heard it's like some kind of video game. It can kind of. It's, it's similar to it, but still got to make them bite. Or, or spotlight with uh, spotlight and deer. Ain't that what they say? <laughs> some people are saying that, but you ain't got a gun. So you can see them. You can't make them bite. It's probably it's closer to like... You spotlighting deer with a recurve boat. You ever tried that? No. <laughs> it's hard. It's still hard. It's not as easy as people think. I bet if I had a boat like this, I could be a pro. I mean, if you think that, I would recommend you get a boat like this. For sure. Because, I mean, it's not, being a pro is not bad. I, I enjoy it. For sure. What does it, what's it, what's it take? What does it take to catch a fish on that thing? The hard part's finding them, which most people can't do. It's hard, it's hard to find them, very hard to find them. I still struggle with it. And then you gotta make sure they're bass and then put a bait in front of them. So it's, there's a, there's like an art form to it. I bet you couldn't even catch no fish <laughs> if you didn't have that. I don't even use it that much, fishing around here. I, I really, yeah, You I don't even need ever, no boat like this fish around here. No, you don't have to have it. Can't, can't be a pro without a boat like this, can you? No, I don't think you can. I think, I think that's the only reason why y'all catch fish. <laughs> That's, that's not true. But how many of you caught down that rooster tail? I ain't, I ain't caught none yet, but I'm getting there. If you had one of these, how many think you'd have caught? Oh, I w they'd be jumping in the boat <laughs> if I had that, one of them. I don't know about all that, man. I don't know. I'm going to go try to catch I, me some, though. I bet if I had one of them, I could take all your money. <laughs> I don't know, man. You're getting a little carried away now. You're getting, you're getting, a, you're getting a hair carried away. No. Kyle, let's go. Hmm? Let's go. Come Get out of here. How much money are you trying to bet on? How much money you got? Probably less than you, judging by your shirt and your shoes. So, oh, <laughs> you'll go that low with me. All right. I, get, I, I take all your money, whatever you want. I bet I could beat you if I had one of them. So if you had that graph, you can think you beat me at fishing. Yeah. Where are you going to go to use it? The whole lake. You're just going to drop it in and start using it. You're going to catch a move. Yeah. It ain't, it, it's not as seen on TV. Well, 
That's why they that's why they make it out. So I guarantee you I can catch it. So we gonna bet on it. Yeah. <clears throat> How much you wanna bet? Well, you got a boat? I ain't got no boat. I got some money though. Well you should buy a boat. Well I got another boat at home. And if you wanna bet on it, I'll let you fish out of this one and I'll get my boat at home. And we'll see. We'll see who wins. We'll fish a tournament. You might need more than a rooster tail though. I'm just what? gonna tell you. You serious? Yeah. You gonna let me fish out of this boat? <clears throat> I'll let you fish out of this boat right here, and I'll fish out of mine. My other one. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. What do you think, Hunter? Are you really gonna let him use your boat? I mean, it's got insurance on it. I've been seeing all this stuff online for so long. I mean, might as well. Screw it. Who you betting on? Don't bet against the bandit. If you've learned nothing else, don't bet against the bandit. We going up river? We'll see. We'll see. Mm -hmm. Really think you can beat me with that piece of junk? <laughs> hey, look, I'm gonna tell you right now, this thing's got a good track record. How about the smoke? You don't care if I leave the GoPro running in that boat, do you? Nah, I don't care. I want you. I want you to get this butt whooping on film. We gonna see, big dog. We gonna see. He don't know about the bandit, does he, Hunter? No. He's about to learn, though. He's about to learn. Hey, we're going to see. How do you, you even operate this thing? See that? That's called a power button. And leave that open like that. Turn I that just, power button I just on. take a five-gallon bucket and fill it up or something? No, it's got a pump in here. I'll show you how to do it. But if you turn that on and leave this open, they'll just jump right out into there. <sighs> no, I don't never burden it. No, I don't never burden it. Gosh. I ain't got no time to deal with it. No, I don't never burden it. Not again. I don't know how long it normally takes you to catch fish. Oh, it, I don't catch them easy now. Yep, yeah, well. Is Two hours. Computer screen they got up here. Five biggest. Five big. Five biggest ones you can catch. You caught five bass. A few times. Trim it down. Trim it down. What's wrong with this thing? You don't know how to drive a boat? Ain't got no power or what? All right, Hunter. You gonna drive for the for our big tournament? Yeah, where are we going? We got two hours. I'm going up river then. Is that where you want to go? We can go, you want to go? Let's go. Doing a little different strategy today. Normally, I wouldn't be fishing like this, but there's only one boat we got to beat, and I don't know if he knows what he's doing, so we're just going to catch a couple keepers for sure. Probably enough to win right there. <laughs> He's over the 12 minimum right there. A little spot. He's been caught before for sure, but take him. Not a bad one. Dose. Two. I need three more. You think you just need three keepers? I think I'm probably good now. <laughs> I don't even know what you, what do you even look for? Is that one? That's a nice one. Take that. It's a dot. Or something. I got a monster. Yeah. 
I got a big one. Oh. Oh, get in the boat, baby. Oh. Oh. Look at that large mouth right there. <laughs> if it touches just right there, that's it, ain't it? That's 12. Ooh. He about to get his butt whooped. I think it's 12. Oh, old school ruler right here. Zero? Oh yeah, 12 and a half. I don't understand. I can see them all on here, but ain't nothing, none of them biting. She's got a mess on her hands. You gotta go get them. I'm gonna get him. This came off right there. Three keepers I've lost. Oh, I got a big one. Oh, another big, large mouth. Woo! Look at that monster. We got to fish for an hour and 55 minutes, actually, to be exact. We caught four keepers, lost three. Two were for sure keepers, one maybe, but they were they were small, so it didn't really matter. But I still think we probably whooped up on it pretty good, I would imagine. So, you know, but I bet. I bet we hear some fish stories. That's how it always goes. People who talk the most junk lose giants every single day. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go check it out. And see my little brother right there. He just wanted to come watch the massacre. Now I don't hear no excuses. Now don't stop talking yet. No What's the deal? I got you. You got me. Yeah. All right. Why are you wet? That little trolling motor pop on that fancy boat. thousand dollars ready? Yeah. So this says sixteen forty nine. Is that what you caught today? Is <laughs> it you was you using my scale? <laughs> Let's see now. Got the pool noodles in there and all. God dog. I'm bigger down there now. Let's see. Big one. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I use two hands, so be. We're gonna have to measure that one, maybe. Let's see. Don't yeah. let, don't get him stuck in the cup holder. He's, he's big enough to fit in there. <laughs> Mouth ain't big enough for your thumb and this. It's a point seven two. You want your picture with him, or you mean just throw him back, or what's the deal? I'm throwing back. Throwing back. You don't want your picture with this one now. I already got one. Ah, little squirmer sucker. Ah, that's a pretty one. They found me. Catch him on the rooster tail or not? All right, that's a 114. That big fish. Yeah, you, oh, you got, got no more in there? Come on, man. I would, they would follow it. I would see them, but they just went by. I, I, I don't understand. Hey, hey, welcome to my life. 0.72, 1.14 for a grand total of 187. Yeah. Point eighty eight. It's number one. One twenty three. All right, we already got you. That scale ain't right. My other fish is bigger than that one. You must. You must be hanging out in the walleye guy. Put something in that fish. One sixty nine. Two twenty nine. So, <clears throat> what was your total? One eighty seven. That one's two twenty nine. So we only had 610, which is not great. But an hour and 55 minutes, middle of the day, it's hard to catch them. Come on, cat got your tongue? What's the deal? Yeah, I guess I guess y'all just make it look that easy. Cause it ain't that easy. So obviously, that was some uh that was a really, really fun video to film. But that was obviously a joke. You know, we're bad actors, but it's still fun. That was a buddy of mine. But we're going to do that on a serious note, though, with somebody. Maybe make it into a series 
somebody gets this boat and I fish out of the bandit and then see how often I get beat. So bandit's got actually got a really good track record. I don't even feel at a disadvantage fishing out of the bandit for the most part. But I think it'd be really cool to have some people come out here and fish against me and my tour boat. As long as you're careful with it. But it's gonna be I think I think that could be a really fun thing to do and get some some of my buddies in there on it and stuff like that. But anyways, appreciate you guys watching. That was funny. Leave me a comment if you think you can beat the bandit and then stay tuned for the bloopers because uh I laugh for most of the day on that one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Look up there. <laughs> uh, I don't think I could do it. What's all them fancy little electronics you got up there? That's a fish call. What's that? You put it in the water and they jump in the boat. Oh, really? You're jumping off in the boat with that thing. Ain't you it? just open it. Yeah. <laughs> I bet you can't even catch any fish without right then. <laughs> you having a hard time? Yeah. Well, this is part of fishing. That's what I'm about to win. That's why I'm about to win right there.